more boxes. There. This is like this is this isn't how unbox therapy does it. <clears throat> Finally, not more plastic. What's going on guys Justin Miller here with a, another tutorial coming at you because today it is Friday and on Fridays I do tutorials and today we're going to learn how to make buttery smooth slow motion inside of HitFilm Express 2017 so guys let's jump over to the computer and we'll get started so as you guys can see we are in HitFilm and what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a new composite shot um, we're gonna set this to 1080 30 frames per second um, so this is going to be our original shot that we like we want it to be into so we have all of our other footage here that we're editing and um then we want to take this shot and turn it into slow motion to put it with the rest of our video so what we're going to do is we're going to make a new composite shot and we're going to set this to 720 and then we're going to adjust the frame rate to 60 frames per second because as you can see right there it says that it's in 59.94 frames per second which is just 60 frames per second so what we're gonna do is we're gonna drag in our footage and we're just gonna trim it so that way it's not like super, super long. Um, so we got the clip here. So as you can see, it's not in slow motion. Um, that's pretty obvious that it isn't. So um, we're just gonna trim it right about there. So it's not in slow motion right there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make it in slow motion. So you're gonna right click and you're gonna click speed and duration. Then we're gonna set this to 50%. That will make it in slow motion. But if you guys are making a new composite shot in 24 frames per second as your footage that you're editing, if the rest of your footage is in 24 frames per second, you're gonna right click. And instead of having it at 50%, you're gonna have it at 40%. But since we're in 30 frames per second, we're gonna leave it at 50. And then all you have to do is you just have to drag in your composite shot and then you're gonna want to adjust it if it's in 720 like mine is you're gonna have to upscale it to 1080 which is about 150 percent so there we go that's how you get a buttery smooth slow motion let's jump back over to the camera so i can do the outro all right i want to thank you guys for watching this video if you guys aren't subscribed already please click subscribe we are super close to 300 subscribers so it would mean a lot if we got there for me and you guys and at 300 subscribers i'm going to be giving away a preset pack so um let's hit 300 here soon um drop a like on this video if you liked it drop a dislike if you didn't and drop a comment down below for a tutorial that you want to see next time and i'll see you guys in the next video